All right, the little kids, this is what makes Christmas so magical. So if you have kids in your life, listen, it can be so hard to buy because there's so many options out there. There's so much stuff and you wanna get a gift they actually play with and will remember for years to come. There's so many things you just throw away within six months. And as a parent, you work hard, so you don't wanna waste all your money on stuff that you are just gonna throw away. So finding some things that your kids are actually going to enjoy and play with, I think is super, super important. So being intentional with your gift giving is crucial because it will help you save money. Now, everything we talk about can fluctuate in price depending on when you buy, where you buy. So again, check out different stores, shop around for the best deal. All right, infant ideas sensory balls. Charles loves these. They like all have different like materials or textures or shapes. I mean, all of it. So it's like great. Teething toy. Mm -hmm. They love just to gnaw on it, don't they? All the time. The name puzzle stool. Oh, this is one of my favorites. So Winston's mom, Helen, thank you. She gives this to the kids every Christmas on their first Christmas. And it's this little stool and it has their name. The little letters come out and it's a puzzle. And my kids Love it, love it, love it, love it. So it's a super cute idea. All right, if there's a toddler in your life, a portable drawing mat, brilliant, brilliant. I don't have it, but I need it for my kids. I mean, seriously, if your kids, especially girls, I shouldn't say just girls, my girls love to draw, love it. So doing that, and also bathtub crayons. Who knew? I had no clue these existed. Like, so cute, so fun. Bathtub stuff is like, it's the best. Kids just have a ball, and you get like at least a solid 25 minutes where you can just sit there and watch and do nothing but watch. It's amazing, it's amazing. Toy binoculars. Yep, I had some for the gentlemen on their gift guide. Get some for the kids, because they're gonna love it too. It's so fun. Books, some great books. Okay, some of my favorites, my two favorites are Who Sang the First Song by Ellie Holcomb. It's precious. And then one of my all-time favorites, You Are Special by Max Licato. I can't even get into it without crying. I cry almost every time I read it. It is so stinking good, so good. So those are some great books that your kids will love for years to come. If you have school-aged kids, one of the best gifts, walkie-talkies, always a favorite. Oh, they're the best. Scooters. Man, my kids love a good scooter, mm -hmm, for sure. It's like their number one means of transportation. Like, I'm like, Amelia has to learn to ride a bike. She needs to learn. She's at the age. She just loves the scooter, and they can go so fast. Even our three-year-old, I'm like, oh my gosh, so fast. Karaoke microphone. All kids love to hear their voices. Like, they think it's hysterical, so why not? This could even be for any age kid, let's be honest. But a good microphone, they're gonna love it. A slime kit. Okay, I knew this was like a fad a few years ago, making slime, but it's still around apparently. So you make some slime. I mean, I don't really get it. I mean, I guess I get it. It's kind of cool, but like, I don't know. But they love it. They're gonna love it. The memories, people, it's all for the memories. Financial Peace Junior, teaching them how to handle money. Now that is a priceless gift. I mean, talk about the gift that keeps on giving for sure. It's the best. Preteen ideas, best time in life. Don't you love preteens? Like that awkward, awkward phase. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, here's my question to all you parents out there. When your kids go through the awkward phase, do you know? Or are you like blinded by like, they're so cute? Like when your baby's born, like your baby's always cute. And then you look back and you're like, oh, that's not cute times. Surely, surely you parents know those preteens and they go through those years. That's my number one question. Comment below, I just really wanna know. All right, if you have a preteen in your life, tie-dye kits. Yes, tie-dye is back in style. They're like loving a tie-dye shirt these days. So get them a kit so they can do it themselves. Virtual guitar lessons through Fender Guitar. So if they love to play guitar, you can get them this subscription and that's actually, you can get three months for free, which is amazing. So they can learn to play guitar. How fun. Taylor Swift had to start from somewhere, right? That's right. A date night with your kid doing their favorite activity. This one might be the best, let's be honest. Spending one-on-one -on -one time with your kids. It's so important, you guys, it's so important. So you don't even have to go buy something. Like, go do something with your kids one-on-one. -on -one. I swear, kids want T-I-M-E. That's all they want. It's really what they want. So spending time with them, I promise they'll remember that for years to come. Teenagers. Mm, mm, mm. I mean, 
guest teenagers are super fun. They kind of freak me out, but I think they're supposed to be super fun. So if you have a teenager in your life, a Bluetooth speaker, I kind of want that. I mean, that's a pretty great gift. Debt-Free Degree by Anthony O'Neill, teaching them how to go to school debt-free. This book, considering the average college debt is like around $40,000, this book, if they read it and apply it, you save them $40,000. Like, it's pretty impressive of debt that they're gonna be in and have to pay interest and all the things. Brands name purses and clothing items from consignment stores. So, especially online, you can go find some great items out there that, again, designer, Designer stuff, really nice, but maybe you get it slightly used or discounted. Yes, they're gonna love it, but you don't have to pay full price. College age kids, yes, they still need gifts. Okay, a wireless in-card transmitter. So your kid can listen to music, all their favorite music, all the time. It's awesome. Board games, gotta love a good board game. And gift cards to restaurants or gas station. I mean, gosh, money. That's all they really want, let's be honest. They need to eat and have gas in their car. That's about it. All right, you can find some great deals on kids' clothes and toys, all of what we talked about at, you know, Facebook Marketplace, consignment shops, like shop around you guys. I promise this does not have to break your budget. Christmas does not, no matter what age your kids are. And if you don't have one, it's not too late to do a Christmas budget. Having a plan on paper, on purpose, really is the best way to save money during the Christmas season. So I created a really fun, printable Christmas budget. So I'll drop that in the link below, as well as a description of all the gifts that we talked about. So hope these gift guides helped you guys again to save money and buy gifts that the people in your life will love.